Be moderate, be moderate. Why do you tell me of moderation? That the blessed Trilus. gods is angry gods. with my fancy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Angry with my fancy. Trilus. I can see you in the devotion. Give me a second. Cressida? We too, with so many thousand sighs, did by each other must poorly sell ourselves with the rude brevity and discharge of one, oh Cressida. Is the lady ready? Hark, you are called. Some say the genius so cries, Come to him that instantly must die. <laughs> Bid them have patience. She shall come anon. I must then to the Grecians. No remedy. A woeful crescent amongst the merry Greeks. <sighs> when shall I see you again? Hear me, my love. Be thou but true of heart. I true? How now? Nay, I, I speak not be thou true as fearing thee. For I will throw my glove to death himself, that there's no maculation in thy heart. I will corrupt the Grecian sentinels to give thee nightly visitation. But yet be true. Oh, heavens be true. What wicked deem is this? Here, while I speak it, love, the Grecian youths are full of quality. They're loving, well composed with gifts of nature, flowing and swelling over with arts and exercise. Oh heavens, you love me not. Die I a villain then? In this I do not call your faith in question so many as my merit. I cannot sing, nor heal the high levolt, nor sweeten talk, nor play at subtle games, fair virtues all, to which the Grecians are most prompt and pregnant. But I can tell that in each grace of these there lurks a still and dumb discoursive devil that tempts most cunningly, but be not tempted. Do you think I will? No. But sometimes we are devils to ourselves. Joyless! Good brother, come you hither? My lord, will you be true? Who I? <laughs> Alas. It is my vice, my fault. While some with cunning gild their copper crowns with truth and plainness, I do wear mine bare. But fear not my truth. The moral of my wit is plain and true. There's all the reach of it. Come, kiss, and let us... Give me your hand. As we walk to our own selves, bend we are needful to all. 